Hello guys, I'm Shazamuddin. Today I'm going to show you how to depixelate images and convert low into high quality images in Photoshop. So let's get started. At first, open your Photoshop software, then open your image. Which image do you want to convert into high quality image? This is low quality image. This is very low quality image and this is just 126 kilobyte at first control or command C for layer copy and then go to image then image size select Preserve details 2.0 and here wide 3000 pixels and resolution 300 pixels and click on OK. Now select this layer 1 and go to filter then sharpen then unsharp mask here 3 and amount and amount 70 and radius it is 10 then click on ok now again go to filter the noise then reduce noise Stand full high and visit details full low. Then click on OK. Uh, create a new layer. Press Ctrl J, duplicate layer, and go to filter. Then other. Then high pass. High pass radius 3. Then click on OK. Go to blending option. Select on sublight or vivid light. Select on sublight. Select this layer 1, then go to filter, then blur, then Gaussian blur, radius 8 pixels, then click on OK. Select this two layer and create a group. Click this uh, icon or press Ctrl Z. Group. Then select this group layer and hold press Alter key and create negative mask. Now select this brush tool and uh, foreground color is white or press X or change uh, foreground color and uh, background color. Make sure to foreground color is white then opacity some decreases 60 low 50 and now easily drag on your face or smooth skin. Opacity No. You can easily convert low quality image into high quality image. Now that is fully high quality image, and you can see that image quality. Now go to file, then save as. Select JPG format, then rename your. Now you can see the image size that is before image 126 kilobyte and now converted high quality image size 1.44 MB that is low quality image and that is high quality image. So guys I hope you like this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, so 
comment below and subscribe our channel for more updates. See you next tutorial. Thank you.